Midway Ice Castles are now open for their 11th season. Reporter Sydney Merrill went opening night and brings the ice castle magic to us here in Provo. Sydney, it looks like it was a cold evening. Bundle up if you're headed to the Midway Ice Castles this winter. Temperatures are below freezing tonight and you'll want to stay warm while you walk around this winter wonderland. Anna Klosser is an ice castle expert. This is her ninth build with ice castles. And she says they usually start planning in October. It takes a lot of work, a lot of planning. The whole castle is planned out before we have a single icicle planted. Yeah. Builders plant icicles, position ice blocks, spray it all down with water, and then let the castle grow. I love okay. it. As visitors walk around and take pictures, Klosser says they're actually walking on about two feet of ice. This family-friendly winter attraction began in Utah and is now in six different states. Event manager Gabby Thompson says her favorite part of the job is creating fun and magic for guests of all ages. Caring for my staff and seeing those magical moments happen in every guest that walks through our walls. Thompson suggests booking tickets online ahead of time for entrance and for their sleigh rides. Our horses tonight are lug and tug. If you guys have questions, feel free to ask me. If you plan on coming to the ice castles, it's about an hour drive north from Provo. Check the weather, check the roads, just to make sure they're open. I'm Sydney Merrill, reporting for Universe Live in Midway. Thanks, Sydney.